Good morning, people. I'm still fired up. I couldn't even sleep last night thinking about what <laughs> oh man, I still can't even think about it. and then I thought about it. The speech that Donald my president Donald Trump gave was incredible, especially when you have. The parents of that young woman that was killed by the terrorists, you had the parents there, I was awesome. And the 100-year-old World War II vet that was there, and he stood up and salute my president. That was incredible. Another thing is, he saluted Rush Limbaugh. Uh, it brought tears to my eyes. Medal of Freedom. Well deserved. But the one that brought me to tears is when the mother and the two kids and Donald Trump was talking about the husband that was deployed in Afghanistan and he said, you don't have to wait that long. He's here. I brought tears to my eyes. I couldn't stop crying. And then after I started crying, and then after the end of the speech, I gotta be good because this is going on Facebook and I got a lot of friends that go to church with me. What this woman did, it was a disgrace. And I think it was a crime to rip up a government document. This woman should not even be Speaker of the House. This woman should be censored by Congress. Especially when she said a couple of weeks ago that she is a Catholic. Really? Nancy Pelosi is a Catholic. And she said she doesn't hate the president. Nancy Pelosi is not. This is my personal opinion, okay? The, the actions, what she does. She is not a Catholic. This woman supports late-term abortion. She is not a Catholic. The Catholic Church strictly says no to abortion. And this woman says that she's a Catholic. And then when she ripped up the speech, she ripped up all the people that were the special guests. The 100-year-old World War II veteran, Rush Limbaugh. The kid that got a scholarship to go to a school of her choice. And that woman did not even stand up. I got to go, because I want to say something, and I don't want to, I got to go.